morning, everybody. Welcome to the lifeboat. I am Captain Tommy. People, we had a great live feed yesterday. That went uh, that went swimmingly, and I got so much feedback from the people in the comment section. I'm sorry, it is so cold in northern Nevada. I got uh, a lot of feedback from people in the comment section that uh, people just complimenting the uh, the crew of this boat, how kind everyone was. Uh, everyone reaching out to them, you know, if you just showed up here and uh, and you see all of the uh, the people caring in this, uh, you know, in the comment section, especially in a live feed where the give and take is right there, it's uh, it's amazing stuff. You people are awesome, really, truthfully awesome. But I can't read them stuff as it's going by. I've had a couple of uh, comments of people who said what I need to do is run two screens. It makes a lot of sense, and it's probably going to be something that I do. Uh, I'm working. There's another. Uh, thing that I might be able to pull off, which I'm going to try because ideally, people, I'd like to be able to look at you and pull this off. So I just uh, I'm trying to figure out a way to get the the text a whole lot bigger. Um, two things: number one, I don't want to do this, right? And uh, the other one is I've watched a lot of live feeds where this is what you look at, and the person is you know checking it out. That it works for a lot of people. Um, I think with the way the uh, with the way the boat is, we sort of engage. I think that there's, um, you know, we sort of, it's it's a different it's a different feel, and it's something I'm gonna get down. We got two, uh, we only got two live feeds into this. This is coming in too. For those of you who remember back in the day, this thing used to be like down to here. It's probably coming back. I don't know. We're gonna find out. Uh, but because of the um, uh, because of the fact that I was not able to read comments as fast as they were coming up. There was a lot of things discussed in the comment section that I didn't uh, get a chance to see. Fortunately, I've got uh, just the best crew in the entire world and uh, several of you actually, one in particular, <coughs> but several of you actually took notes um, and wrote down things that, uh, you know, that were fairly important as far as you were concerned that the captain got a look at. Uh, so turned up turnip. I know I'm saying that wrong. His uh, turn up, turn, turn up, tur the two turn ups guy. So uh, uh, both he and his daughter are under the weather, people. So some positive energy, you know, some thoughts and prayers going that way. Kyle Clark. Kyle is somebody that means the world to me. So I would really appreciate. Uh, turns out that he has the, um, the 16 plus 3, the same uh, way that I did. And uh, boy, now having, uh, you know, been... I shouldn't say been through it. I'm still going through it. You know, there are still some issues. I'm a lot better, obviously. But uh, having been there and done that, or been there and doing that, I feel for him. So um, that's Kyle. Kyle Clark. He's been uh, he's been on this boat for as long as there's been a boat. And thoughts and prayers going out to Kyle, too. Oculi Mortis is a close friend uh, of the boat and of me personally. And he... Uh, He's probably too old to be playing on those one-wheeled things. First of all, you shouldn't stand on something that only has one wheel. I'm just saying. That's probably not, you know, it's, uh, yeah. So it's like a one-wheeled skateboard. You've seen these things, and they go really, really fast. And uh, they're, they've got this gimbal or something in there so that it's like this balance thing. Well, it didn't work too well for him at least one day. And he uh, severely injured himself and has been healing for, my goodness, a long time. But uh, he's having some issues, uh, particularly with pain, and uh, we'd like to keep him in our, uh, our thoughts as well. And, although it didn't come up in the comments section, uh, my brother Rhett, uh, Grizzly Heat Griffith, has um, been having some, uh, some issues with the largest nerve, you know, one of the largest nerves in the body, you know, which is the uh, femoral nerve. Is, uh, and it may be a... Um, a leftover of the uh, the 15 plus four, but we're not sure. And uh, some thoughts and uh, positive energy and prayers going out to him as well, because that's uh, he's another you know great. Everybody on this boat's great. They really are. Um, we're it's funny people. We're thin in the herd, so to speak. There are people who just um, there are people for whom this isn't the uh, the answer, and this is uh, or at least maybe not at this point in their life. But uh, the funny thing is, as the people who seem to uh, you know, to dislike the boat or dislike me or dislike you uh, seem to be um, to be dropping out and walking away. The numbers are still going up, which is uh, great. It means that we're getting the whole simpatico, right? We're, get, we're bringing in uh, people that uh, see the vision of what we're doing. 
and uh, are here to support one another. And boy, he couldn't do any better than that. If you did tune in to yesterday's live feed, you know that Mr. Mark Wages, uh, his his daughter, has uh, strep throat, and it was kind of a vicious um, kind of a strep throat, really hurting. And uh, so obviously that's uh, more thoughts and prayers. But because of that, um, we had to do sort of an impromptu um, live feed last night. And <clears throat> people in the future, you have my word of honor that I'm going to have a backup plan <laughs> in place so that in case um, at the last second I have to go live, just going live, that I'm going to have some kind of a cohesive, uh, um, you know, things to talk about. The, uh, the the live feed went well. It really did. But, you know, I was sort of all over the place because of the, uh, the fact that I kind of... Um, I think it was the 40 seconds of preparation that I had to put, to put into the uh, to put into the show that created a, a bit of a scattered uh, um, yeah the curriculum um, I guess it was uh, was scattered it's kind of all over the place but uh, it still went smooth and you guys don't pick on me so well I shouldn't say that there was a Captain Fantasy reference yeah I know who you are um, and uh, I think Rhett Griffith and you know and his friend were having some fun with the captain, but that's okay. That's all right. It's uh, the day is coming. You'll be scrubbing decks. It's coming. And make no mistake, people. Um, there's a brig on board this boat. Oh yeah. Yep. So because of what happened yesterday with Mark's daughter, we did not go um, live with the interview with Mark. We will this evening. You hear me? We will this evening. So six o'clock Pacific time, we will be going to uh, to that interview, and we're going to be doing it um, from the uh, Life Boat Studios. It's going to look a little different, people, which is cool, right? Um, there's going to be some stuff that uh, you'll get a chance to see some of the uh, some of the changing face of the boat. People, the mission's never going to change. Uh, you know, the anytime there are changes to this boat, there are going to be things that uh, can bring in more people. <laughs> and uh, help the mission, so to speak. But uh, nothing to fear, I assure you. But this is, uh, is going to be a big, um, this is going to be a big look, uh, big change in terms of the look of, as far as professional goes. We, wanna, we want the, the, uh, the same spirit and we want the, uh, the best product possible. But make no mistake, people, we want a product that, uh, that appeals to the masses, at least to get them through the door. Then if the message doesn't, uh, doesn't jive with theirs, Fantastic. We wish him the best of luck. Uh, now, a couple other things. I talked to a few people, you know, a lot of people that aren't getting the notifications. That is an ailment that happens. Um, it just, it's a YouTube thing. Sometimes notifications go out, sometimes they don't. However, if you did not hit all, right, when you hit the, uh, the ship's bell, gives you the notifications, there's uh, the default, right? If you just hit, click that, you're not going to get every notification. The default setting on it, um, is just a, uh, a more limited version of, um, uh, you know, of notifications. You want to scroll down on that until you hit all. If you do that, <coughs> sorry, people, if you do that, you're, uh, you're going to actually get notified in theory on every, uh, thing that we do on the boat. Anytime a video goes up or I go live, you're going to find out about it. However, tonight when I do the interview with Mark, um, I will give you an email address because I'm going to start doing this on my own. I'm going to start sending out a uh, email blast to everybody before the uh, the video goes up because in theory, people, the, um, the system at Gmail is going to be more consistent than the notification system at, uh, at um, YouTube. Just, you know, and, and I've talked to people a lot, you know, Chase the Heat wanted to do this. When you got a hundred thousand people and you try to, to make a change like this, it's difficult, and the organization of it becomes staggering, right? It's uh, trying to organize a hundred thousand uh, or fifty thousand or whatever show up into uh, that kind of a notification all at once. We require a couple of employees, and uh, it would just be a struggle. We are in our infancy, people. We could absolutely pull this off right now. I have secured one email, um, our own bell at gmail.com. Before you send anything to that, uh, there's going to be uh, one other one that we're going to try to get. So tonight, I will go over that, people, I promise. But the big news is 6 o'clock tonight, Mark Wages from Wages World is going to come on and we're going to talk to about his 
his story of um, you know of addiction and then uh, ultimately of triumph because the man's got uh, 10 years which is just good stuff right it doesn't get any better than that unless it's 11 years <laughs> uh, people down here oh one last thing before I go down here the live feeds the uh, because of the streaming service that we use once I'm done going live it pops up on the screen you can go and click on it you can watch it after the fact if you were late then it is going to disappear it disappears into um, a playlist so if you go and look at playlists you're going to come across it's going to say the lifeboat live or lifeboat uh, streams or something along those lines it'll be obvious which one it is but that's where all of the live stuff is going to go and people um, there are going to be a lot of live. I'm going to do a lot of it in live. And as I get the, uh, the, um, chat feature dialed in a little bit better than me going back and forth with question and answer is going to be a lot easier, but the format for live really lends itself to this boat, not just because uh, of this aspect of it, but because of the, the comment section, it really gives interaction from what I heard uh, and feedback from a lot of people that someone would come on yesterday and say, well, I'm having a struggle with this. And instantly, you know, everyone would sort of come to that person's aid. And that's the dream of the boat, right? So I think that uh, you're going to be seeing a lot more live uh, than than not. You know, there's obviously, especially when I go back to work, doing lives are going to be a little bit more limited. You know, it's not going to be something I can do all the time. But I like the format. I really like the format. And uh, so far, the feedback that I've gotten from all of you says you like the format. When we start doing them routinely, uh, <clears throat> we'll probably try to get to a, a certain time. I, I bailed off yesterday because I started to feel uh, like I was keeping people there too long. And then I got a ton of feedback that said, man, don't, you know, you don't need to get off. Just keep talking. You know, the fact is nobody got off. I mean, during the course of that live feed, we were very consistently at the same number of people the entire time. Uh, when I looked at the analytics, I was, uh, I was very, very pleasantly happy, pleasantly surprised. And lastly, people, we have a goal of getting this puppy monetized, right? So that once this boat um, cuts a deal with YouTube, we get pushed to the four corners of the uh, earth on our boat. The live feed brings in a lot of hours, right? It, uh, it really jumps up the amount of time that you get toward that 4,000 hours. So I appreciate all of you that hang out. I appreciate all of you that watch the entire thing. And I appreciate everybody that goes back and watches videos and does whatever to try to get this uh, this boat to its mission. We're getting close, people. We are really getting close. Um, my goal, I think I said right from the beginning, I wanted to be monetized by Halloween. And I thought, and when I first started, I thought that was kind of ambitious. Now I'm thinking uh, maybe we, uh, we didn't, aim high enough. I think we'll probably beat that. But uh, thank you for all of your help, people. Now, officially, down here, we've got some things. You can click on one of them, and you can join us on this boat. And then I would recommend that you do that. Hit the bell notification, ship's bell, and you will see uh, everything in theory that I do. Over here, or over there, there's also going to be videos. You can click on those videos and start going through and looking at all of this stuff. Number one, good stuff in there, people, truly. And number two, you're going to further the cause of the boat, getting us closer to the finish line faster. I am your captain. My name is Tommy. I will see you tonight, 6 o'clock on the West Coast, where I will be interviewing Mr. Mark Wages, people. I can't wait. God bless, and do me a favor, people. Go save somebody.